Passing. What's up, everybody? World War II Gaming here today. Hey, uh, I am here with Waterside Alarm 1. He will not be playing with me. However, he will be providing commentary. Say hi, Waterside. How you doing? So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to have every map available for assault except for forward airfield because I'm just tired of that map. I've gone it every single time. Today we're going to be playing with the, my Panzer III. Yeah, hopefully we can get to the Hetzer. Here, as you can see on your screen, I mean, I'm at 5,778 out of 10,000 towards the Hetzer. Here, and I only need about 13 grand more until I will be able to buy it once I get that experience. So let's do this. Okay, where are you currently at with your German tanks? Waterside. What was that? You cut out. Where are you at with your German tanks? Uh, Panzer three unlocked. I'm not sure past that, really. You really need to get a Panzer III, that way we can play together. Yeah. I know you're working on that 1903 rifle. Oh. Uh, mine's almost a one-shot kill. Honestly, I can almost- I can- If I wasn't going for the Panz- If I wasn't going for the Hetzer, I could afford to buy the Scout II barrel, which would make it a one-shot kill rifle, but I'm not going to. Hmm. I play tanks more, honestly. I really like that aspect of this game. So have you gotten your recording software to work yet f to be able to broadcast? I have not. It's, uh, it's going along, though. Do you want me to recommend a uh, recording software? Sure. It's called XSplit. It's what I use. That's what I have. Okay, good. It's really simple how to use. Like, all you have to do once it's set up, control tab, it shows record or stream. You just have to be logged into your YouTube account. Sick. So, Waterside, do you want to explain why you're not playing with me? Uh, crippling lag, really. How so. can we fix this problem in our nation? <laughs> Move my router. <laughs> Where is your uh, router currently? In my uh, older brother's room. Why is it there? Greedy. Greedy brother. I always uh, go in in the middle of the night, take it and move it. That's surprisingly not as simple as that. There's a, uh, it's a router mode and combo, and there's a, another separate router that we have in there. Of course, both of them are in his room. So Why don't you bring the other one out then? Yeah, I don't know. I, for some reason, he said it has to be in there. But... He might be lying. Have to no, really. He, he has to have two routers in his room, and that's mandatory so that something will function. Yeah, sure. Yeah, no, right. That sucks for you. It does. So everything in the house works poorly because of that. Oh, yeah. Why don't you petition your parents? I have. I have, but, uh, you know. Results? Uh, negative. Spoiled older brother? Yeah. Alright, I got a battle. We are, well, I am on the map of Factory and it is Assault coming from the southern portion of the map. You know which one I'm talking about? Up on a hill? Yeah, we are, I think so. we are facing Soviets, so it's likely that they have T 34, model 1934, I mean, model 1944s. That should be fun. Oh, deploy queue, even better. Oh, wait, I actually instantly got out of a deploy queue for once. So why has that happened? <laughs> Never. They have a model 1942 and a model 1944. Nice. Aha! I just stole a kill. Aha. Even though I got credits for Savior kill. Like, there's just this, I just spawn, I see a T-34 sitting there, they're shooting at us stuff, and I'm just like, okay, hey, the guy next to me shoots it, then I shoot it, and he's dead. Would that qualify as a kill steal or self-defense since he was aiming at us? 
or at least that pinky one. I just heard a shot. It wasn't a tank shot, but it was a regular shot, which I do not like is near me. That is near me. Their model 1944 only has one armor kill, so that leads me to believe that this battle is kind of like Well, I just killed infantry with my machine gun. He was on a bike, so extremely. Oh shoot, how's my tank this damaged? PTR D41 somewhere? Repair it, quick hit. It's being shot by a tank. This thing's going down. Let's run to the hills, run to the hills, run to the hills, run to the hills, run to the hills. I wanna make it, I wanna make it. I made it behind a tree, oh my god. I'm safe. Kind of, except for the tank is, is watching me. I see the guy that shot me with the PTRD. Those things are hard to detect, like you have to be watching your armor level. Because if they don't wake up to the center. Yes. Yes or no? Uh, they, they don't really. Uh, I don't think they have too much, um... They don't have any... They they have, like, one major recoil, and then it's back to perfect game. Yeah, and it, it's a very long reset time with the, uh... pseudo bolt action. It's actually not a long reset time. I've actually picked up the weapon before and used it. It's quite fast firing and for that kind of rifle. Did I just surprise you with that? Uh, I'm slightly. So, do you know where I was when I got shot before? I made the stupid mistake of going down the road in between the mountains. Do you know which one I mean? Uh... Not entirely. So, where we spawn, there's... Our final base is up on a hill and there's a little room structure across from that and then there's... There's kind of a warehouse. Yeah, do you know where I'm talking about? Uh, yeah, slightly. So anyway, I went I went down the path in between that. That was a great idea by me. Got shot by a PTRD and a T34. Let's see, is it can I shoot the T34 from here? Okay, I almost have name on, I think. It is effective, but it, uh, it has been nerfed. It, um, I'm not really entirely sure how. Ooh, Soviet tank. <laughs> ah, yes, he's not going now. Probably. Unless he didn't see me. I think I'm in the clear. I to sneak behind him. It's a model 1944. I can tell by the elongated back on it. No! It was an RPG-43. Come on. I mean, I basically killed this guy and someone's just going to pick up the kill. Unfair. I hate... I mean, the Russians have so much more anti-tank than every other faction. Uh... Kind of. This is an yeah. RPG-43, they have the only anti-tank rifle. Yeah, but, um, I guess that's true. The, uh, the other countries don't really, you know, country factions have... Like, Germany's uh -huh. specialty uh -huh. is good tanks, honestly. And better they, they have the Pentstruck. Yeah, but they, uh, they definitely lack anti-tank capabilities, but they have the, uh, 
anti-tank SPGs, you know, the uh, tank destroyers. Yeah, the Hetzer and the Stud. Mm -hmm. One of which I'm very close to and will be very close to trying out. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's an amazing vehicle, at least so I've been told. It, it actually only yeah. costs like 163 per spawn, if you can believe that. Yeah. See that Russian tank again. I don't know where he is now because he went behind some trees from my perspective. Eh. That wasn't on me, thankfully, but I think there was a tank shot. Oh, I see him. I see him through the trees. Yes. Got him. I killed the I killed the model 1944. Now let's move before he finds me. I cannot engage that thing from the front. It will kill me faster than than anything has ever killed anything. Hmm. Faster than Hannibal slaughtered the Romans once he got into the city of Rome. He doesn't know what to do. I keep killing him. I think this was the model 1934. I mean, not 34, but 42. You know what I mean? Yeah. Now I gotta move again. This time I'm gonna sit behind this spawn. No, I know, spawn time, uh, blah, 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 that's bad, whatever. Mm -hmm. I mean, seeing as I've only died two times so far, and four, I have three armor kills, that's pretty good. I just tried to shoot at a Viking completely missed. Oh, he just respawned. Hit. Hit, but two, armor too thick. Armor. That was a hit through his armor. Another one through his armor. And he's dead. This is just painful for him, probably. I mean, I keep moving every time slightly, but just slightly closer to where he's going to spawn. Yep. So he can't really effectively just turn his turret exactly to where he was killed from last time. Yeah. I kind of don't like the whole kill cam thing. Like, it gives too much information. Yeah? I uh, heard. He spawned in a different location this time. He's got me. He's got me killed. I just feel like my tank have to get behind the tree. Oh, he got me. He spawned behind where I was this time. Ain't that like a pony? It is. Well, someone in the comments has just said fucking fuck this. I wonder what happened. Oh, SU-85. Kill them. Kill seal right there. That's how we do it. Some guy was just throwing RPGs or whatever, and, and then I just completely destroyed it. And do you know why I didn't like it? That, I, some guy was just like throwing sticky grenades at him, and then I just, I just shot at him because he couldn't keep up with him. And got the kill. But that that yeah. puts me to five armor kills, giving me 379 XP. And there's a Russian vice going down. How many did you say? Five? Five armor kills, yes, already. And three lives. This is my fourth life. And then hit. In there. What? You, uh. What, well, you have to get 14 more and four lives. Why? Oh, 19. Then you'll be able to rival my uh, so it, game I played a couple days ago. He seriously thinks I couldn't see him? What an idiot. Like, he just shoots at me with a with a regular rifle. I just turn. He He's laying down. He just turns slightly away and I just glare and do another machine gun. Like, 
Oh my god, I'm right behind the tank. Boom. Boom. Oh, crap, I don't want to see it. Ah, the model 1944 got me, but I got the model 1942. So that's a, that's a pretty good trade-off. Yep. And an armor kill is an armor kill. Now, yeah. time to pull off a serious flanking maneuver, as you would say. Go for the Rebel Aries. What? Go for the Rebel Aries. I'm sorry, I, yeah, I couldn't hear what you said. I said go for the vulnerable Aries. What I'm doing is, I'm going sideways along the mountain instead of up the mountain right now. Yeah, so, that works. Yeah, you have that weird sliding. No, I'm not Those sliding. I, ha I have enough power. Now I'm sliding because I hit a tree, but I recovered it within like 25 meters. Maybe. Yeah. I got killed by a Mark II grenade. But anyway, I ran at this guy who was throwing anti-tank grenades onto me, and I just hit him with my wrench right in the face and killed him. So, I'm going to do something you might call me crazy for doing this. I'm going to try and engage a T-34 model 1944 from a front area. Uh, if he's distracted, if he's uh, turned maybe 90 degrees from front, opposite to you, he might be able to put at least two shots in the and hit you. It takes three shots to kill. Oh, maybe three to four. It takes him two to kill me. Yeah, so I get okay for Come on, you got the power to do this. I know you got the power. On your little tank. Just keep going. Uh, no, I'm sliding. <laughs> this is just like, absolutely hilarious how much I just slid. I'm still going. Like, once you start sliding, there's no stopping. Oh no. Yeah, yeah. Oh. I just saw a huge shell. But I can actually take on a T-34 from the front with the, with the ABCR shell. Yeah, you just gotta aim for that lower plate, you know, directly below the uh, axle in the front. But he's right he's right actually now. got his back to me right now, so... Come on, my shot. He's dead, yes. And he had a bow gunner, so that's two kills. Someone has a PPRD. So accurate. I have to get to a safe spot to repair. I lost four armor points if I did go on T34 now I'm dead.
I'm literally just using my tank so that I don't have to hold crouch. I'm third on the leaderboard. I have 571 in five lives. I mean 572 because I just got more XP for repairing this vehicle. I mean, I should be far enough back now so that whenever they spawn, they're in front of me. but I'm gonna make some good XP. I have the most armor kills on my team. Okay. Yeah. Funny how like when you're not in the zoomed in mode of your thing, like everything looks like a tank. Yeah. Like some parts of a tree look like a tank when they're low hanging. And when you zoom in they're not really there. Yeah. So I'm just honestly waiting here, waiting for a teeth waiting for a tank to be killed, that way I can kill the tank. Their armor. Their armor is a lot. Ah, sh shit. A Russian town. Me. Bail, 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 bail. No, he had it. And my tank didn't die, I don't think. I think he can steal it. Oh. Crap. Hopefully, he just leaves it thinking it's going to die, right? Yeah. I think he's I think he's actually leaving it. Nope, I just heard another one go off and my tank just blew up. It's not even worth spawning. The battle's over in like fifty seconds. Forty seconds. That was pretty productive. I got five hundred and seventy seven yeah. XP. I got ten kills and six lives. I got one headshot and seven armor kills, the most on my team. Very good. Eighteen seconds left. It's not worth spawning, is it? Probably not, no. I mean unless you're right on top of somebody. And that's game. I'm actually going to give that four stars. So an eighty two X P gained, even though it said I only had 577, 8,461 credits minus 1,068. How much did I say that I had gained? Wasn't paying attention. 8,461 or 60 something. Yeah, 8,461 minus 1,068. That's about a net gain. Of a, gosh, damn! I already forgot what I got again. I know how much I lost. So that's about a net gain of seven thousand and uh, three hundred and ninety or something like that. Pretty good. Yeah. So that puts me at sixty-two thousand four hundred and eighty-six, which is just four, just half. It's about three and a half k away from. No, not three and a half. What am I saying? The Hetzer costs 68. So it's about five and a half K away. Oh my, I made like 2000 XP for 
or armor assault? Let me check. So armor assault. Armor assault, I made 1,764 XP. Nice. So anyway, that's where I'm going to be ending my video. Oh, thank you to everyone who watches and who has subscribed. I hope everyone has a great day. And if you like this video, please subscribe. Bye.